Alright, we're gonna move on to the single wrist up when we get a guy flat. Right, because that's where most of my attacks are gonna be off of is when I get the single wrist. Right, if he's on his base, I can really wear that shoulder out, but I'm kind of limited in the, the types of scores I can get to. So what I really want to do is get him flat, either go for my head scoop, okay, or get the hand on the back. We'll go with the head scoop right now. Same setup, we'll bump him forward, pull him that side chop, run him flat. Okay, if he bases up here, okay, again, anytime I'm riding the near wrist, I want him off his elbow. If he's on his base here, off his elbow. All right, if anything's touching on that side, I want it to be the shoulder. Okay, as soon as he can get weight on his elbow, that means he can start driving off, start shifting where my elbow is. Okay, so here, all I'm gonna do is circle, circle and pull, pull it down. Right there, now I got him on his hip. Okay, for my head scoop, I do it a little differently. Okay, I'm gonna take my right hand here. As I'm circling, I'm gonna come to the wrist. Okay, this is why I like to go Clogger. It makes my head scoop easier. If I'm grabbing here, then it's harder for me to get the right elbow position, right hand position. All right, so I got my claw grip. Okay, so I'm with no thumb out here, claw grip. Now I'm going to circle. As I circle, right hand coming to the wrist. Now, I'm not going to step next to his head. I want to step right on his face and start pulling his head in. See how that kind of cranks his neck? Okay, so I'm circling, I'm going to step, and I curl his head in. Now I'm just going to rotate. My elbow is right in his spine. I'm keeping this wrist, okay? I'm not going to pull it straight up, right? That's going to make nerves, refs nervous. All right, this hand starts coming by. So I like to keep it folded. Okay, I'm folded right here. Now I'm going to drop my chest to his elbow, and I'm going to pull in. Pull him up. Now I pinch his head. Punch, sit, come over the head, under the head, wherever you want. Over the head, it's tighter. Okay, but I'm pulling everything in. That's just gonna raise his chest up. Bump, get my elbow, put it down. Okay, circle, pull him down. Elbow's still over top right now. Over top, driving down, so he doesn't wanna come up. Circling, I'm shifting my right hand to his wrist. On his face, curl it towards me. Starts turning his hips. Now look. Okay, elbow, right on his spine. All right, this thumb's pointing straight up. Dropping down, pull everything in, pinch, sit. This knee stops him from being able to bring his chest down. All right, if I'm here, sometimes he can belly down and I start getting a big fight. Here, it gives me that extra second or two to go come over top and finish it. That knee's, once his chest comes up, that knee's sitting through, block him from coming back down. All right, one more time. Bump. Circle. Scoop. Keep the constant pressure on that head so he doesn't want to come up. Pull, pinch, set. Then cover it. All right, one, two, three.